Hey, it's Magnus here. In the comments in yesterday's video, quite a number of you wanted to see a more close-up view of the titanium salt and pepper shakers. So that's what I'm gonna do for you right now. Right, first things first, super macro lens. Man, I'm still surprised at how, you know, how a lens can completely transform sort of the visual field and whatnot. So this, this here, is the grenade version of the salt and pepper shaker. So as you can see, very raw. Hopefully this will get so zoomed in you can see the tiny little bars and things like that. Right next I will show you the twist version. So as you can see that's pretty Pretty raw, the machining is um, phenomenal, but you can still see the machining lines in it. And now I'll show you the grenade version that's been tumbled. Just so you know, this is part of the way through the tumbling process, it's not fully finished, so it's not perfect, but you should see a, you should see a decent difference. I'll do a quick side by side, should give you a bit of an idea. And now I'll show you the twist one that's been partially tumbled. Now I want to mention one thing and that is you will still see machining lines on those titanium shakers and other products I do when you look at it on video or on photo like when you do a, a full HD video or a you know a, a high megapixel photo you can see lines that you you just cannot see with with the naked eye if I pick up this tumbled version here and I look really really closely like if I get the light just right I can see machining lines just in corners where the, where the media can't quite reach. But on video and in you know good resolution photos, it, it easily zooms in. So I know pretty much on what I just showed you that you will be seeing machining lines and, and that kind of thing on there. But in real life, in practical terms, you can't see them. Not unless you get in close with the right light and you know really look into the corners. Right, this is just going to be a short video today. I went back to the workshop earlier. You know, we've got a few small issues with uh, the tie shakers that I was showing you earlier in, ter in terms of the tumbling process. You know, we're getting little, little marks on them uh, because of the tumbling process. So, we've got to figure that out. And, you know, it's a pain. It's funny, it's never ending. Like, you, you think you get ahead, you're like two steps ahead, and you, you know, you get a step back, you know, you got to... It just never ends, but you know, slowly but surely I get used to it. But what I'm gonna do now is leave you with a quote, a very good quote, one of my favorites. I've never heard it in a long time, I completely forgot about it. But here it is, it, it's useful for any situation or, you know, when you're feeling down or when things are on top of you or whatever, I think you'll like it. It's by Richard Carlson. And he said, ask yourself this question, will this matter a year from now?